to have Graham Phillips from IDT on our future booth at Embedded World. And we've got some of your demonstrations and reference designs here. Can you take us through the IDT view of what you've got here, please? Sure, no problem. Well, good morning, everybody. So what we have here from IDT, there's two technologies that I wanted to talk about. Uh, we have our inductive position sensing technology and we've got the uh, indoor air quality uh, technology as well. So I wanted to, to uh, just talk very top level. So this inductive position sensing technology, it works on the same principle as wireless charging. So you, with your phones, so the same principle. So the, the benefit means that uh, there's a contactless solution versus what's on the market today, uh, which makes it more robust. Uh, and more durable and the total cost of ownership for this solution compared to what's available today is uh, much more competitive. Um, it doesn't contain a magnet um, and it doesn't contain a sensor element so the actual sensor element is these little PCBs, I don't know if you can zoom in on that. Um, and again, so what that means is competitive versus a Hall effect uh, and also, it's less susceptible to EMI, which is great for automotive, uh, agricultural vehicles, etc. So what we have here from, our, from us is a complete starter kit that customers can buy through Future. Uh, the software is downloadable from IDT.com. Uh, and you have uh, three sensor modules for the different types of uh, position movement that we're looking to, uh, to detect. So, probably the most accurate solution on the market today, below 45 degrees, and above that is very comparable to uh, existing technologies available. So that's this solution. Uh, I then wanted to talk about the uh, indoor air quality. So indoor air quality in general is becoming a real hot topic. So if you just think of the emissions issues with uh, vehicles, uh, and also companies are looking to improve the indoor air quality with inside office buildings just to make uh, uh, people work at the most, uh, most efficient uh, and keep them awake. So what we have here is, is, a, is a complete module, a complete platform that can be used to sense uh, various um, odours, uh, various gases and uh, it can also uh, estimate uh, CO2 and there's a lot of companies looking to, uh, uh, to, to do that. The benefit of this solution is that you can use it for um, measuring different types of odours, so you can customise it for um, different applications. So, for example, you could have the same solution uh, in your bathroom, in your kitchen, because there's different odours and smells associated with those rooms. So that's um, one area. Then you've also got customers looking at odours in terms of transportation of fresh produce. So when they detect that some of the produce is going off, they can remove um, uh, the faulty stuff. So all of the software is downloadable from uh, the IDT website, so it's easily upgradable. Um, and then on the, for the estimated CO2, it's ideal for environments like, like this, for example. So it, it can measure the, the gradual increase of CO2, or estimated CO2, as opposed to a, a step function. So in, in this sort of environment, or in the, a meeting room, you can connect uh, this uh, through the IoT, you can connect this to you know, maybe something that opens the windows or turns on the air conditioning, uh, that, that, type of, uh, that type of approach. Um, so again, this is our first uh, generation. We're going to be coming out with things that are more specific to ref uh, refrigeration. There'll be an outdoor air quality uh, sensor. So it's definitely a, a, a growing market for, for everybody. So that's what I wanted to cover today. Hopefully you found that informative. Uh, I'd just like to give, thank Future for the opportunity to do this. Thank you. It's a pleasure.